the party of Republicans. As you should party join. Of <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you guys think? Any well, you know, thoughts? I have something to say. You know, Come I'm on, twittering man. right what? now, family. So, if you want to Twitter me, go to um, Shirley Hussar H U S A R, and you can Twitter me. Today is the dark night because uh, we're going to talk about <laughs> Black Attack. As you can see, I got my Batman on. I'm fuming. I'm heated right but now. But what I would, what, but what, what I want to get back to, uh, or, or also touch upon, in addition to what we're talking about with this confederacy nazi month is the black attack that you're talking about that you've been talking about on facebook I'm not talking the about black on attack exactly. on black conservatives shirley's very concerned about this and she's speaking out against people that are coming up against and i have to say shirley yeah i i've seen plenty of the chatter uh, um they're, they're being called spooks that sat by the door they're being called mm. oreos mm. uh uh um what, what's the other, word? I mean, I, I'm really the other word i'm really upset about this you know uh, about you know, a black conservatives being traitors right. and or not being accepted by conservatives. That to me is just that. It's what kind joke. of America are we living in? You that, guys that, 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 so that, that is the I question. can't even believe that. You Don't get me wrong. I am not a Republican, yeah. but I think it's stupid. That's like saying, well, you can't be a liberal because you know you're of color. Okay, so, so this is governor. Who's the governor? Uh, we have Asshole? written down as... No. McDonald's. <laughs> oh, McDonald's. McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. Now listen, 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 listen. McDonald's. This is Bob McDonald's office. I just want to let you know, I'm calling government, I'm taking a risk, I'm calling Governor Bob McDonald's office right now. And I, I, I just have a question for them. And, and I, you know, Douglas, why don't we just McDonald's ask... McDonald's office, may I help you? Hello, Governor McDonald's office. You're um, we're alive on the air. This is yes, Shirley Hussar with HipHopRepublican.tv and .com. We had a question. Uh, we're a group of African American urban Republicans, and uh, I wanted to know if maybe you can help us or if we can have a, a conversation with the governor today. We wanted to talk about the Confederate. We're trying to understand the purpose of uh, allocating and putting in the Confederate uh, law that he wants to put into place. We're trying to have an understanding of that. Can you help us? Well, ma'am, in order to request a meeting with the governor, you need to put that request in writing. Well, even okay. if we don't need a we don't need a request from the governor, can you help us? Do you have any information on what's going on with this crazy Confederate History Month going on? What's what what is it? What can you help us? <laughs> Hello, uh, are you there? I think Hello? she hung up. She on hung up. On and they don't want to deal with it. Hello? <laughs> this is not a prank call. We, we really would like to know. The governor of Virginia's office. Ah, oh, they oh, choked. I'm, that was a good one, Shirley. Yeah, I'm going to call this ass okay. live. Okay, I'm calling her back. Good. This is I why think, I'm her son. I'm think thinking that, in my head, you need to call her back right now. I think that's you a black woman. You need to call her back. <laughs> she working oh, for the, listening carefully. Hold on. Let's see. I think she's working for the master. <laughs> She don't know what to do. That's what she's going on. She put us on hold. <laughs> she's scared now. She put hey, us on Virginia, hold. You know, just so you know, vote, vote that man out. So know. and so out. <laughs> vote that fill in the blank. Hello? Out. Hello? Oh, my God. You know, this is the key thing that I always think. They don't want to You do should it. have the right to call your governor and we call him out. You know, we just called and we got hung up on him. We're an American citizen. We're we're people of the community. We just wanted to have an answer. Ma'am, I didn't hang up on you. I was talking. I was getting ready to ask you a question, and the call just went away. I didn't hang up on you. Okay, okay. well, what were you going to say? I don't even remember now. What, what, were you, what was the last thing you We'd did like to, to know some information. Respond. We'd like to know some information on the Confederate month that the governor's trying to put into place. In Virginia? It's already put into place. He issued a proclamation name in April. It's why? Why would he do that? What is that? Can you let us know what that is? Well, I can tell you where to find it on his website. And you can read it yourself. Well, you know, this is my question. You sound like a black lady. Uh, you know, as a sister, do you support Confederacy? I mean, you're working for the white man now. Do you cons support Confederacy? I am not offering an opinion at this time, ma'am. But you should be able to voice your opinion, you're a constituent of that city, ma'am. You, you live in Florida. I, 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 Virginia. I can, Virginia. I, Virginia. If I want to, but I choose not to is what I'm but, but see, but you, you, you disenfranchise so you your own people. Silent? Yeah, you choose to be silent for us. I, I, I choose not to answer that. Now, if you want to ask me, I'll answer it. 
No, all I'm saying is you can help us out. You can help your own people by, you work for this man, obviously he's a racist. He didn't even want to instill slavery. I mean, I'm an American citizen. I have the right to ask my governor or any governor for the state that you live in or don't live in questions that have to deal with what he wants to make a proclamation. So you're saying that this month is already instilled. Are the African American people, being African American, living in Virginia, are they outraged by this? I don't know, ma'am. You, you, are you not You're, outraged? Are you outraged? Are you upset I about this? I told you that I was not offering an opinion at this time. Oh, okay. So yeah. would you consider yourself an Uncle Tom? Well, I am not offering an opinion. I am not offering an opinion at this but time. But you should have an opinion. You're in 2010. I know you want to keep your job because everybody need a job, but they don't need to be a flunky for the white man. So I say to you, because I don't know if you're a Republican or a Democrat, it doesn't matter because it's beyond Republican or Democrat. It's about an African-American woman working for a white man that wants to put you back in slavery because he doesn't even want to ex acknowledge it that it exists. So are you a slave now in a different format? I will not offer an opinion at this time. Okay, who can we talk to that can give us some substance on this phone? Because obviously they got you well trained. Who can we talk to? That's the show. Well, I, there's no one in Florida that can help Virginia. or talk to us. So I'm in Virginia. 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 You're in Virginia. You're in Virginia. Is there anyone else in this office, ma'am? I'm serious. This is a serious matter for us. A lot of us are hurt and upset about this. We do not want to go back in time. This is another way of trying to enslave black people. But we have black people like yourself working for a governor that obviously it seems like you're supporting his matter. So if you can't help us, can someone else help us? I'm, I'm not sure what type of help it is you're requesting. We'd like some information on what it is and where it's going on. Okay, Can we get a voice to telling to us? That's what I was saying when, when the call hung up. I was saying I can direct you to the governor's website and you can read it for yourself. We've what? already been to the governor's oh, yeah. website. And we we'd need, like we need to real... get some voice. We'd like to get someone telling us and, and what so happens, we can hear it. And what if if someone calls and they don't have internet access? What if they cannot go online? Not everyone has that. You know what? I'm trying to be helpful. I'm going to end the call. You all have a good day. I need to be transferred. Can no. you transfer us? Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> she hung up. I of just can't she believe. Hung up I just cannot us. believe. Uncle I cannot believe Virginians allowed this. I'm. You know what? Then no offense. Pass. No offense. I can say Florida's Virginia. Well, you Florida. all in Virginia. Sorry, Virginia. Well, oh, but, but, oh, you guys. man. Oh, oh, what's big, going on? Oh, Republicans in Virginia. Bad. Somebody talk no, to Virginia, me. Virginia. No, well, not just Republicans. Virginians. Yeah. Well, Douglas okay. now. Yes. Doug, they had Douglas Wilder on the news the other day, who was the first black governor, okay, mm -hmm. African American governor of Virginia, uh, who stated that during the time he was in office, he actually did have a referendum <laughs> that he put out that acknowledged the 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 history of the South and also acknowledged slavery. So he indicated that this had actually been done before in a way that was more sensitive to black folks. This is coming from Doug Wilder, who said it was done. They've had previous proclamations, so he didn't see the need for another one. He's, in other words, he said while he was in office as the first black governor, okay, that he issued a proclamation uh, that acknowledged their history, but also acknowledged the effects of slavery. And at that but time, it was a much more inclusive. Obviously, he's not the only one that he's not just saying this. Well, he was pissed the, off. He the, was the saying state passed it. Well, that's what he said. He was saying there's no need to have this again. He was also insulted, too, like you okay. all, that it was okay. going down, especially okay. in light of the fact that they had had previous referendums of this type in Virginia, and he also was indicating how he did not feel these types of things represented the true state of Virginia, and he said that if it did, how would he get to be the first black governor? Mm. <laughs> wow. It so, sounds so, like so, we so are it's controversy. No it it's just that there's people against it, and pe apparently there's people for it. I don't know. Apparently I mean, there's people like, for it. Working in Florida. What's your uncle Tom? Not Florida. Virginia. 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 Whatever. Virginia. The state. Virginia. Special people. Hi. How you doing? Special. They're not the same. They're separated. By okay. People. Well, we don't really seem to be going anywhere. <laughs> Virginia. We, you, you saw us make the phone call. You guys out the, there on the web. It Virginia. They, they hung uh, up I tell on you, us. tell the family. Families. They hung up on. I'm going to give you the number. Somebody needs to yeah, call. Yeah, the family. You, we don't have to call. be the only one. Call. Call. Them, and because you have the right to call. Say the number, let me, let me say this number to you. I want you to call this, this lady. I push number four. Call now. Seriously.